This is The Tough Hub, a show brought to you by Tough Africa Global to educate you on real estate matters, to mentor you and inspire you. It's after 48 years of working and also traveling all over the world, I am ready to share my experience with you, especially those young ones who follow me for inspiration. City, favorite place in the Gambia. It's hot, sun shining, and I'm ready to explore. It's been a while. Let's go. <laughs> I'm back. Wow, guys, it's been ages. I know, but we've been busy. There's been so much going on. Ramadan, Lent, the workers. But today, I'm here, hot and bothered. I'm going to tell you all about it. First, let me get some cold water. Water, anyone? Where can I get water? Stick with me. It's going to be a very upbeat one today. Welcome back to Taf City. Sorry it's been so long. We had Lent, we had a Ramadan, and you heard me earlier just ask for water. It's funny I asked for water because we've had a couple of months of making sacrifices. And a few minutes ago, I felt like I was dying of thirst. But of course we know that we are able to make sacrifices. So we've talked about goals. Today I want to touch on sacrifice. Just a simple word, I won't sing it. My voice is horrible. But I'll use my voice to speak to you about sacrifices, the little things that we can do to make sure that these goals become a reality. Because you know what, I'm sure you're sitting there thinking, I'd love to buy a house, it's easier said than done. Where will I get the money from? And you're right, it's not like it's gonna drop from the sky, or is it? No, it's not. It's not gonna drop from the sky. So what we need to do is think about small steps that we can take to make the big things happen. Small steps of stuff that we can all do. We've just done it. We did Lent and Ramadan. You know, for Christians, they did 40 days of fasting. We had the holy month of Ramadan, where from the dusk till dawn, everybody was making small sacrifices, giving up on water, food, whatever it is we felt we had to do. Now, that really helped me realize what we can do today to make sure we own a home tomorrow. Tomorrow being in 12 months. That's how long it takes for a TAF home to be built. But yes, yeah, so if we walk around and we ask people how much they spend on lunch, on little luxuries, things that we sacrifice during Ramadan, I think that's a good place to start. I know during Ramadan, I didn't buy my expensive lattes and flat whites. Now, if you're in the UK or America, let's say the UK, you're spending about £3.65, a minimum or maybe more, on a tall flat white. Now, when you put that down and you think £3.65 a day, five days a week, seven days a week, multiply that by 52 weeks, that's your deposit. That's your deposit right there. And if you're in the Gambia, let's go ask the people that love the tapalapa. If you haven't moved to Gambia yet, you don't know about tapalapa. It's the best bread here. You know what? I'm not going to be the one. Let me just ask. Samson, come on. I know I, I know you hate this, but I need you here. Come on, come on, come on. It's a quick one. It's not even a construction question. How okay, are you? Fine, I'm good. good. How much do you spend on food every day? Well, average of 400. 400? 400 dollars. Yeah. That's, that's the basic one, apart from the ones, maybe grocery at home. Yes, like and not the luxury, not the dining, this no, is just no, basic. No. basic yeah. 400 every day. Yeah. So seven days a week, that's $2,800. Roughly, or 300. Just call it 3000 yeah. should we round it up? Yeah. 3000 Austin, do the math, 3052 weeks in the year. 
basic minimal. Basic minimal. One hundred and fifty-six thousand. Yeah. One hundred and fifty-six thousand. That's just a little bit over twenty-five percent deposit for a plot in Tulip Gardens. Samson, can you see? Fine. Make some packed lunch. Sure. No more buying lunch, right? Yeah, sure, sure. sure, sure. <laughs> okay, keep going. I'll come and come and find yeah, you later. Thank you. That's so just much. one example. So yes, cut down on the tap tapalafas. Yeah. <laughs> cut down on the tapalafas. Make right. your own pack lunch. Yes. The and right. then you save hundred and fifty-six thousand. I know we're all dying to see Sava. I know. I saw the comments. Sava, Sava, Sava. But let's go see Dana first. We'll come back to Sava. Let's go see Dana. Let's get back. Let's go. <laughs> Off to Vena, we go. I've got a whole hamper to talk about in Vena, and then we'll head to Saba. Let's go. Kumba, what are you doing? Hey. Is that a video for your clients yes. or for you? How are you? Oh, what's that? No, don't get excited. What's don't get got? excited. Okay. Not gifts for you. Okay. You can see a tough ball. <laughs> Kumba loves receiving gifts, but she's the gift that keeps giving. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> Today oh. is about the customers. In yes. fact, hold this. Let me get my board. Okay, <laughs> okay. <laughs> what are so look, I've been doing all oh, my little oh, notes. Good. Yes, so ignore this. This is my personal mind, body, oh, spirit. Okay. Okay. Good vibes only. Mm -hmm. But focus on some of these things I have here. I mean, you know some of these. Mm -hmm. I put 5% discount. Just yeah. explain that. What does that mean? So the 5% discount is when you're going for the cash payment. Ah. People, when you go for the cash payment, you have a whole 5% discount. 5% 5. discount. Not two, not three, not four, but 5% discount. I got five on it. Does Wait it a minute. Five. Yep. Let's put five on it. 5% uh -huh. discount. No, not the ball yet. Leave the ball there for now. So we'll leave this here. There we go. So that's 5% discount if you're a cash buyer. It doesn't get better than that. Now, tell me about this. 25%. So that 25% deposit is the money that the clients are supposed to get for the deposit. Clever girl. Yes. <laughs> so come with pass the test. Of course she has. She's a salesperson. But 25% deposit. So that means somebody looking at this and looking at that whole big figure yeah. can say, let me focus on 25%. 25% deposit. Okay, let's get this number two out. So there we go. Two. So there. 25. 25% deposit. Yeah? Now, I get excited about the next one. So our customers, last time we did the update, we didn't have the 24 month payment plan. Please explain to them what that means. Yeah, I'm so excited to announce it. <laughs> Go on. So, this 25% deposit, you can have it on a 24 month payment plan, meaning depositing 25%, then the rest of the amount you can split it within two years, which is 24 months. Let's do a dance. With, with what? Interest. Free. Interest free, interest free. <laughs> so so yeah. interest free for two years, yeah? yeah? Oh my god. Years. Okay. So what do we do with that? Let me just hold on to this. Hold on to this. What we got? We have it. Okay. So now we get rid of the five. We put the four. So the option. So 24 months. Is that your number? 24 months? Yeah. Yeah? With a 25% deposit? Now, tell them the last one there. 10 year mortgage plan, hit me. Uh -huh. So, the 10 year mortgage plan is that same 25% deposit. Uh -huh. Then you would have 10 years mortgage plan, as in the banks would give you a loan of 75%. Then you'll be paying bit by bit every month up to 10 years. So, you don't need to rush, you know, just sit, relax, calm. You have a whole 10 year to go. So, the ball is in your court, Kumba. Catch it. <laughs> Catch the ball. There we go. There we go. The ball is in your court. Look, the sad news is, I was, look, I'm not sure if you know this, Kumba, but all over the world, not everybody is going to be a homeowner. It's just the truth. Unfortunately, there will be some people that will rent. There will be people that will own property. It's just the way it is. No fingers are equal. Life yeah, is unfair. But you can be a homeowner. 
you can sacrifice. Yes. And sacrifice starts from the little things to the big things. You can sacrifice on your lunch options. You can sacrifice on these gold trainers that I won't be buying anymore. I mean, they're not even gold anymore. <laughs> it's the small sacrifices that we make so we can make the big, big rewards exactly. come into place, mm -hmm. right? Hard work always pays off. Hard work pays off. Let mm -hmm. me ask you, what's your number? Are you a 5% kind of girl? Cash? Yes. Are you the 25% yes. deposit? You know, for me, whatever would favor the customers. I wouldn't want them to lose that, you know, discount. Yes. At least go for the 5%. But like you said, the fingers are not equal. That's right. So if you can go for the cash payment to have the 5% discount, you still have the 25%. That's why we open all those because we want to make sure more people have homes to live because, you know, Living under a roof or under a shelter is everything. Yes. If you want to step it up and be a homeowner, you have to make sacrifices. I'm sorry. Yeah. That's the bad news. The good yeah. news is the ball's in your court. <laughs> it's a football, not a basketball. <laughs> October. <laughs> okay, and then just bringing it back to options, the mm -hmm. issue of options. Because yeah. we want people to think Taft City, options. Yes. Payment plants, houses, they're options. all available. Okay. Now, one example of that is this house. This binta. house is very, very, very impressive. Uh -huh. So this is a binta. This is a binta house. And you have the same one on the other side. Over there, yeah. So what's the difference? It's the same design, the same building, but different plot sizes. Okay. So like okay. I said, we have different plot sizes. Mm -hmm. You can choose each plot size that you want, and we have the same building for you. I mean, like, literally, we could race in here. I'm sure I'd beat you. Let's go. Come on in. It's a live, walk and play, so we're going to start playing. <laughs> you keep oh, talking. no, you cheated. Oh, you cheated. <laughs> <laughs> you cheated. <laughs> you lose. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> oh, wow. This is great. Yes. Okay. So everything inside is the same, everything just the bigger. Inside, right. High ceiling. Uh -huh. And you know the binta is very spacious. Yeah. The living room and all that. Okay. Let's go and talk about Saba. Saba, Saba, Saba. That's all we want to talk about is Saba. And I have Samson, head of construction, to give me all the technical bits that you need to know. So, you know what, Samson? You're welcome. Since we last spoke, yeah. as you know, yeah. now Saba Cluster One is 90% sold. We're 90% sold in Saba. Wow, so great. this week we released Cluster 2, yes. which means a lot of work for you. Yes. Yeah. How are you yes. getting on with Saba with the ones that are bought already? What's happening? Well, it's great. It's moving fine. It's uh, moving uh, fine? Top structure are going fine. Yeah? And, uh, Should we walk towards yeah. it? Why not? Yeah? yeah? Good, good, good. Mm -hmm. So in terms of you now, what does this mean for you? More work to do? I mean, the more we sell, the more you have to build. Yeah, and the, the more the merrier. So the more the merrier. The summer, yeah. Okay, you hear that? The more the merrier. <laughs> Head of construction, Tough Africa Global is up yeah. for the challenge. Yeah. Right, so this is Sava. Yeah. So obviously there's not really much to see in terms of infrastructure. Yeah. But I'm sure you'll explain to me what's going on. Well, immediately we deploy the, uh, the dry plants next week, uh -huh. meaning the equipment. Yeah. yeah we'll cut our, to our levels and then import the uh, lateral filling material. Compact okay. Them Slow down, Samson. Lateral filling, all. Please make it marketable for me. Okay. <laughs> so what does that mean? Let's well, keep going. You know, you have the natural vegetation soil. Yes. You need to cut it. Okay. And get to the suitable strata. That's the harder ground. Okay. We take off this one. We use them somewhere. That's the one we use to backfill our okay. greens with and what have you. Okay, so you take it from here. Yes. The extra sand. Is yes. that the right way? And then you move it to we somewhere move else. move it somewhere into the compounds where where we plant our greens and what have you. Okay, so like here, what, what's going on here? What's this? Uh, that's a septic socket for. For, for, the, for, the, for the gate, gate house. house. Yes. Okay, so everyone, we are in Saba yeah, now. Yeah. Okay, so can you walk fast, Samson? Yes. Let's do this. <laughs> okay, so tell me. This, this is cluster one. One. And then here is cluster two. Number two. Number yeah. one, number, number two, two, number one, number two. Yeah. Okay, yeah. tell me about cluster one. What's yeah. happening? Here you have your driving. Basically, the access road, we have cleared them, mm -hmm. cut them to the best level we want mm -hmm. and uh, substructures are all going on the 16 units we have here we have how many what kind of houses do you have in the 16 uh, units you have mixed use you have the two bedroom you have the three bedroom and then you have the story building what's more popular popular is the two and three two and three beds yes, the okay hajar the hajars and the nafi you hear that yeah. nafi and okay the, the show house yeah. 
Okay. Yeah, as you can see, mm -hmm. we have we have done the oversight concrete on one of them, and the block works are all all going there. Okay. Hopefully by this week, next week, by by this time next week, we should be able to have uh, uh, three or four ongoing at least to lentil. Wow, that's amazing. Yeah. We lentil stage already in cluster yeah. one. So we can go in more. So yeah. You want to show some more? Okay. Yeah. Go on. So and what's happening here? What's this? This has been uh, backfilled. Backfilled. Uh, yeah. And then we have put water. Mm -hmm. Compact them in layers, uh -huh. 15 to 20 or 30 in some cases, and then we are waiting for it to like dry a little. Then we compact down it again. Wow. Okay. Yeah. And what's this for me? It's just a big gap for me to fall in. Somebody tell me this what is, this is. This is our drainage. This is drainage. Yeah. Uh, it's meant to take away water that all the runoff. Uh -huh. Some have been catched or trapped from uh, Bena, Didi. They all come in here to be lowest stream okay over there so we have them in four bits you have one over there you have just before the saba mm -hmm. fence and then you have internal internally here in saba then you have another one far end over there right because earlier on in the week yeah. media team do you remember we went out and there were these big is that the same thing the same thing yeah so that's how it starts yeah. up and then you yeah. organize it we to organize look a bit. them so we now have some of the catchments mm -hmm. Some of the some of some of the runoff to be catched into here. This is the bigger catchment. It takes it all to the drain down there because there is the lower gradient. Right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Nice. So you can sorry mm -hmm. watch. So you can see this is a culvert where you have a ramp for cars to move in here and divert it to here. In cluster two, yeah. also we have the the three seven six and slash. 377, a double floor, 750 square meter. That's the last house after that car. Right. We, we just cleared the place and then. The that's the first one that's been sold in cluster, in cluster two. two yeah. So cluster two was released this week. Yes. You've already sold two plots. We've already sold two plots. No, things are going too fast, yeah. Samson. Too so fast. Here you can see them. This is 313A. You have 304, 340, and the rest of them. As you know, Saba is three, mm -hmm. so the plot numbering starts, with, starts three. with three. Nice. Yeah. Okay, yes, so I noticed also Bena, all the plot numbers are one. One something. Okay, and then Dini is two, two something, Saba is three. Yes. Nice. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. Can we just stop and take a moment? Can we just like mourn my trainers, please? This is the end of my golden shoes, no, no, Samson. It will, it will love you. This happened in Saba. <laughs> <laughs> Saba owes me. <laughs> yeah. Okay, great. So cluster two, bigger corner plots. What else can we look forward to? Yeah, the, 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 better, the, the road network's good. Okay. Yeah, the majority are spacious. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, spacious the, plots, yeah. yeah. And then here you have mixed use. Uh, we align them in such a way that you could have one story building mm -hmm. and then two bungalows in this row right yeah. got you yeah so it overlooks these ones here and then backing the other things like the mosque yeah. and what have you later and well and also it's not just the plots that have been selling we've also had some development we've got star oil a petrol station has yeah. been built yeah. oh. and that's right in the front isn't right it right in the front and yeah, that, we at saw least they're that. up to lintel level or so yeah, yeah so that's moving hopefully, quite fast hopefully Early, early, end of this year, early next year. Early next year, we'll have a petrol station yeah, here, sure. and that comes with a convenience store. Yeah. Wow, that'll be and good. And then also the agriculture, the farm. We've got the farm. Yeah. Oh, Samson, I tasted the watermelons. They were <laughs> yummy, yummy I'm, watermelons. I'm sure, I'm sure. And I've got some onions at home. That's right, I'm yeah. using the onions. All, Live, all, work, and play. All farmed here. All farmed here. Yeah. Oh, it's really good, yeah. really good. Yeah, okay, good. so, Guys, like it's said, Saba is all about seeing, yeah, it's yeah. believing, I yeah. suppose. And as you can see, there's a lot happening, happening here. Yeah. A lot, right? Just as I said, some, they are all at different stages. You can uh -huh. see that compacting, making it ready for placement of concrete on the slab. Yes. Slot. You also have this done yesterday. And this is where we are with the lintel level. Okay. And we changed our strategy uh -huh. this time around uh -huh. to mitigate some of the challenges we had last year in terms of rents and what have you. Right, the, the rains the last idea, year were a challenge. Yeah, so tell me, what are we doing this year? This, this, this time around, mm -hmm. immediately we open our, uh, our substructure, that's the foundation. Mm -hmm. We dig our soak away at the same time we get them all. Okay. And we've changed our pattern of soak away, where we made them semi-complete septic. Meaning, 
we don't allow so much holes to take in water to avoid also issues of the roads are not okay what we do is to bring all the material that we took off from the road the, the top vegetable soil mm -hmm. which is suitable for our agriculture later mm -hmm. which is also suitable for our greens in the campus and put them where we need them later so we are doing that to like take advantage of this dry season so that we will not have issues later like this plot now we hit this one it will be moved to their designated plots since okay. this plot this is an empty plot but it's not yet uh, we have not started works on it so we pile them here so that we will now take them at the, at, the, at the end so as you can see you can see them all at the back right yeah these are plots where you have those uh, arrows marked. yeah this is a plot delineated from one to the end to the other caught you so you will now put the material at the back so that construction can go on in the front later we just have to spray it yeah hello afternoon yeah. how are you afternoon not bad yeah here we are what on is this one what, here you know we the... are on saba two three uh, three two six eight. do you know what the size of this is this is uh wait well, uh, let me check in the brochure three two six a yeah what is what is square 49 square meters. All right, so this is a uh, Mariatu. Yeah. So Mariatu is the smallest property you can get in Taft City. Yes. 49 square meters. So, yes. and this is the smallest land side, 187.5. Oh, yes. So start from here. Start from here to the end of the wall. To the end of the wall. Yes. Okay. Yes. So now, what is this stage? What do you call this stage? This is a superstructure stage. Superstructure stage. Just after stage. Your, uh, your, your oversight concrete. So now you take all your blocks to lintel, lintel mm -hmm. them up to roof, roof beam. Up to yeah, yeah. Now, uh, hopefully, today, tomorrow, they will be up to Lincoln. Okay. On this. Okay. Yeah. But, yeah. And how long ago did we start building this? Well, uh, just uh, three weeks ago. Wow. Yeah. Okay. And why we had to? It takes us long. Is uh, we need to import good material for the underside filling. Yeah. Not overside is the on off. So for the underside Oversight filling. Oversight and the underside. Yeah. Coupe, <laughs> decale. Yeah. Overside and underside. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, as you can see, similar to this now, mm -hmm. we add the material in mm -hmm. layers. Mm -hmm. we, we, we mix them with water mm -hmm. uh, and then just for consolidation. So, after it's been consolidated, we now compact them for better consolidation in this. So, looking at this, this is cluster one. Yeah. Yeah. The entire of this. The entire, this is all cluster yeah, one. Yes. Right, so yes. Saba Cluster 1, just there near the gatehouse. It's a really good location. Yeah. And then you said obviously you have the mosque as well and the church, yeah. which would be over there. More so over there. this would be quite close to that. Well, not so much. Not so much. Yes, yes. Very close. <laughs> yeah, very close. Yeah, very close. So, okay, this is Cluster 1, Cluster 2. Where will Cluster 3 be? On that side or other side? Yeah, and then one, two, three over there. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Are you proud of your work, Samson? Well, so much, so much, yeah. so much. Always. He looks to the camera. And so us, much, always, 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 always. We're very proud of you too, yeah, Samson. Yeah. <laughs> He's doing a really good job. Yeah. <laughs> so what yeah. do we have here? Is this a house? I mean, I could live in this. I'm short enough. No, this this uh, suck away and septic. Oh, suck away yeah. and septic, this not a house for me. <laughs> Meaning, this is septic in the sense that all the effluent, all the waste that comes that is generated from the house, mm -hmm. comes in here, settle where you have anaerobic digestion takes place and then all the decays happens in a simpler term. <laughs> <laughs> Samson is very technical. Yeah. Anaerobic now, digestion, he said. What we do more here, we don't leave the hollow blocks open. So we hollow fill them, which is called solid filling. We hollow fill all the holes so that amount of water coming from the underground surcharge becomes less. It's really, really technical stuff. Yeah. I mean, I'm sure you guys probably got it more than me. <laughs> I mean, I thought it was a house for God's sake. Yeah. But yeah, good to know. So away from the conventional, we also uh, uh, flow the entire ground. Okay, one thing about you, Samson, you're not very good at trumping your own horn, so I'm going to help you. I tell me, why is this Sokoway different from what normal people, average builders build? What are we doing here that's different in Taft City? Well, we hollow fill the size completely. Mm -hmm. That's, and then we, we flow the base. We Why are we doing that? Is we're running away from the high table of 
water under uh, water, water water grounds that because are you did your survey and you realized yes. exactly how close yeah. to grace so that's yeah. really important yes. you should have done how how soon do you do that before you even get to this stage i mean how long ago was that done would you say we do that at the early stage early preparatory stage so the early preparatory stage you do yeah. a survey yeah. so you know exactly when you come to build yeah. where you need to pay particular attention to where to pay particularly the water table level and mm -hmm. then also how bad and good the nature of the soil will be okay just to determine your foundation levels mm -hmm. and also to determine some of the issues you could have potentially with the underground water. And that's responsible building yes. because you're going that one step extra, extra. to make sure to make that, sure that you don't have now. issues later. That's great. Yeah. You see something, you've got to say these things, okay? You've got to say that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, so, guys. Okay. When I'm talking what is he doing? What's going on here? He's compacting just to have, compacting. Yeah, just have better consolidation. And what is this plot? This is compacting. Yeah, this so we're compacting. compacting. Yeah, this is a uh, SB. That's uh, Saba, three twenty nine plot. Right. Yeah, it is a two bedroom. Two bedroom plot. Yeah, yeah. same one for uh, forty nine square meter. Oh, it's another Mariatu. Yeah. So another Mariatu. Is yeah. it on a bigger land? This yeah, one? it's on a bigger land. Yeah. How big is this one? Uh, one eighty something or so. Three twenty nine. Wow. Okay. This is yeah. So this one's I mean, I'm all down for proximity, but Good. this seems a bit close, don't you think? Well, there are three units. It all belongs to one client. No, stop right there. So three different houses and one buyer. Yes. Oh, wow. This is amazing. Yes. So they've got what? What is this one? This is a two bedroom at uh -huh. edge. Uh -huh. By the left, and you also have another two bedroom. So two two beds right. and a three bed in the and middle. Bedroom in this the middle. must be for investment. Having a central get at this close so oh this is a close yeah so yeah. basically this is Absolutely. pretty much yeah. all theirs yeah all right so yeah. we have our lucky client yeah. that drives in and he's got three properties three. all here and yeah. it stops over there over there yes do you think he's gonna rent them all out or is he gonna live here or well i mean not, i don't know for now for him but i'm sure if he will rent some and then leave maybe some for him. amazing look guys mm. the last time we did a progress video we didn't have the 24 months interest free option and we have this now which means that you just need 25 percent deposit and then you have 24 months to make those monthly payments. Mm -hmm. Look, some of those payments are as low as the rent you're paying now abroad. So imagine that two years of sacrifice, this customer owns three houses. Think about the return on investment. Let's focus on you. We're going to go back to those numbers again. Austin, get your calculator out. Samson, tell me. Yes, yeah. Close to two. Well, close to two is nicer in the sense that it has some best uh, natural vegetation. Yeah. You have ups and down hills that gives you different uh, gradients and then also, also, also some healing. Uh, so that means you can get views of the stream? Sure. Okay. Yeah, which the stream is not far from here. The stream is not far from yeah. here? Yeah. So if you recap, so this is where we've just come from yes. basically. Yes, yes. And then in terms of the river, yeah. you want to point it out to me? Yeah. You can see the bluish. That light blue. Light one. They are light, yeah, light stream. They all collect to the to the big body water here, right. which is the waterway, okay. or, or, the, or the river or, or dams over there. Okay. Now, this is the, this is our cluster one. This is here we are. This is at the, at the most. So we're actually what would be a moss. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then this the, this the, this this the fence that is just directly behind us mm -hmm. that separates the mosque and then the cluster one, cluster two of the summer. Okay. Yeah. Here is exactly where those 16 units where we just came yeah. from. You can see the road network. Yep. You can see the cluster that I explained to you. And the close? Yeah. Where's that close you showed yeah, me? You see? There it is. Yeah. So that's that and then you have the three plots, three, three plots here. Wow, that's a really yeah. good. Can you zoom in on that? So that lucky customer yeah. driving here and those are his three houses just there. Yes. Okay, and then the bulldozer, where was that? The, close the bulldozer to you? is somewhere here with the right. closer to. And then this is, this is where you have all those hills, those undulations, yep. and then the, the greener vegetations over there. Wow, this is great. And that makes sense because you've got the agricultural centre there, yes, yes. greenhouses, horticultural farm, yeah, yeah. because natural vegetation is great over here. Yes. Perfect. This is great. Oh, okay. <laughs> Right, it's been a fantastic day. Just thinking of how far we've come, you know, laying the foundation stone, now growing, and now eating what we grow in Taft City. Those watermelons were yummy. Got onions, got tomatoes, got lettuce. 
It just keeps giving. Taft City is a city that keeps giving. My favorite place in the Gambia. And in terms of updates, more updates, I think you're gonna see a lot of updates coming on a regular basis now. There's things happening. Just there to my side, on the right hand side, we have King Baker. So King Baker, if you're not in Gambia, small company that does lovely pastries. Now imagine them being based here in Taft City for Taft City residents. By the end of the year, we'll have a petrol station right at the entrance. That footage should be coming up now. And that's Star Oil, and they'll have a convenience store, just as you would in any petrol station. So this infrastructure, there's amenities, it's all coming together slowly but surely. Slower than the rate of the sales. Now that is picking up and that is going. Every time we come here, it's this is sold, this one's coming up. And believe me, it's happening. But the good news is, there's options, there's payment plans, there's plots, there's house designs. It's a choice, it's choice mania here. So really take it all in, ask the right questions, take the steps you need to take so that you can own a property here in Taft City. And if Taft City isn't for you because you are one of those people that's plot ready but not house ready, then Tulip Gardens. Look into Tulip Gardens. There's five year mortgage plans. You can buy a plot there, anything from 250 square meters to as big as you want really. You can buy multiple plots and then just save that land. Secure that investment and when you're ready to be house ready, you can build there. But for now, thank you for watching. Keep watching the TAF Hub. Subscribe, follow, share. And you know, we welcome all feedback. We we'll just keep getting better and better and better. If you don't see a progress video, just know there's a lot happening and we'll bring it to you when it's ready. Thanks again, see you soon. I think you don't like that. Now, hey, what's up my day? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Gangster. Coupe, décalé. Coupe, pas décalé. Thank you for watching the Tough Hub. Until we come your way on our next episode, subscribe, like, and share.